Congressman Derek Van Orden says a protesters assaulted him during the RNC in Milwaukee. Western Wisconsin's congressman says he was a victim of political violence. I've called for anybody committing political violence to be prosecuted to the greatest extent of the law. That applies to Code Pink, not just us. So when we were in Wisconsin during the Republican National Convention, we were standing online trying to get into an event and this guy, a big guy, he comes like barging through one of our staff people. She didn't know who he was, he came from behind. And it turned out that he was a congressman, this Derek Orton. He accused her of having pushed him. And not only that, he called the police to have her arrested. I think it was because she's Palestinian American and was wearing a kibbeah and he didn't like that. And he had her held in jail overnight. He said that he pushed her so hard into this concrete thing that his hip was hurting him. Then the charges were dropped. And guess why? They saw the body cam footage, which we just saw that showed she didn't do anything. I am not gonna allow some glory-seeking, Hamas-loving <laughs> slipknot <laughs> interfere with that. It ain't happening. We have the same rights as these code pink buffoons. Don't move. Do you see that? Don't do that. Oh, okay. Hey. okay, don't touch me. You just assaulted touch me. a member of Congress. Yeah. No, I didn't. Yes, I yes, stood in front of you. Hey, you, you were just cutting just me and I went in front of, of you. When the congressman tells officers he wants to press charges, they move the congressman's group forward in line where the body camera captures this exchange. I saw it. She didn't have me. I agree. I really want to beat the crap out of those people. Jesus, man, this guy's a good dude right here. The questions they're going to ask is, uh, do you feel pain? I, I have really bad pain. Yeah, just me to yeah, that's so, yeah, I've got felt pain. Yes, my hip, uh, my hip hurts. I mean, it hurts already. I, did she exacerbate? I don't know. Right. But a hip check is a hip check. Yeah. Anyway, we came here to make sure that his hip was okay and ask him to look at the footage and give an apology to poor Noor, our staff person, who spent the night in prison thanks to Van Horn. Hello. Hi. Hi. We wanted to check in on the concert and then his health. Uh, uh, I'm not sure. He's in Wisconsin right now. Oh. Yeah. Well, you know, um, we were in Milwaukee when the Republican convention was happening, mm -hmm. and one of our staff people, uh, he accused her of pushing him, and that he was, I think he called it hip checked or something like that, and that his hip was hurting him. Mm -hmm. Do you know if it's okay? I, I'm not sure. Well, we just want to make sure he's okay. And then, you yeah. know, we saw the body cam footage came out. And oh, yeah? Yeah. You should take a look at it. The body cam footage showed that she never pushed him. So it was kind of weird that he said that she pushed him and that he got hurt from it. Mm -hmm. And um, he sent her off to jail overnight. And she's Palestinian American and it was really, really very sad for her and all of us to see her in jail mm -hmm. overnight for something she didn't do with the congressman saying that he hurt her. Mm -hmm. Not hurt us. I think he should apologize, mm -hmm. you know, especially he should take a look at that body cam footage.